This is one pile of boats of the type that are often used by migrants in Sfax. Traffickers have increasingly crowded people onto such makeshift, poorly constructed vessels for the perilous sea crossing to Europe. Such vessels are very weak, easily capsize, and often disintegrate not long after setting out to sea. Several human trafficking networks are known to be operating from Sfax. Irregular migration has become more organized through criminal networks operating in the Mediterranean. Criminals are making millions without worrying about the fate of desperate migrants. They are making iron boats, but the result is that there isn't enough space in the morgues of the hospitals of Sfax for all the dead migrants. The state is waging a war against human trafficking networks. Analysts believe that increasing political and economic instability, combined with armed conflicts and insecurity in many African countries, could drive up irregular migration towards Europe. Tunisia could be destabilized by this new wave of migration, as migrants usually depart from the North African country to try and reach European shores. The security and political situation in many sub-Saharan African countries is alarming. Tunisia has recorded a new wave of irregular migrants following the crisis in Burkina Faso, Niger and Mali. We are expecting tens of thousands of migrants to arrive from neighboring countries. This situation is very dangerous because Tunisia alone cannot stop all these migrants on its own. Tunisian President Kaya Said has vowed to tackle human traffickers. The head of state has also urged Tunisian youths to avoid risking their lives in irregular migration attempts. Irregular migration is not a solution. Enough with irregular migration. We will provide the right conditions for youths to stay here in Tunisia or migrate in a regular manner by respecting the law. This is our approach. Tunisia has recorded many victims of undocumented migration, including youths, children and women, due to human trafficking which causes death. People must find hope and jobs in their country. Tunisian coast guards recently rescued 23 people and recovered five bodies of migrants. Houseboat sank off the coast of Sfax. The boat was carrying mostly Tunisians, but also a number of sub-Saharan African migrants, including women and children. The coastal region of Sfax is the main point of departure for tens of thousands of undocumented migrants. Tunisian authorities have intercepted more than 2,000 makeshift and iron boats carrying migrants en route to Europe since the beginning of this year. Dozens of traffickers have also been arrested. Adnan Shabashi, CGTN, Tunis.